Hey guys! Thanks for watching the replay. If you're watching the replay, you can comment hashtag replay below. All right, I'm gonna just adjust my phone slightly. I just ordered a new ring light stand the other day. I'm waiting for it to come in. I thought it would come in today, but it hasn't come in yet. So just making do for now, but I'm super excited for that because my lighting should be a bit better. So I got some new eyeshadows in, so I can't wait to show you guys. I got eight new colors. These ones here on the bottom, they are all nude colors super pretty so I'm gonna show them off today so I'm gonna get started with some eye primer and I'm actually gonna prime my face too because I just washed my mascara off and my face is kind of dry so let's start with some eye primer this is our eye primer it makes your eyeshadow appear true to color, last all day, not crease, all that good stuff, okay? All right, so eye primer is on. Hi Cam, hi Megan. So I got some new eyeshadows in today. Oh, my nose is itchy. I'm gonna prime my face while I'm at it. because like I said my face my skin is super dry today because I just washed my face and I didn't moisturize well actually I didn't really wash my whole face I just took off my mascara because that's all I was wearing and now my skin's dry so I'm just gonna prime it before I put on my foundation later I like to let my primer sit in a bit okay so I'm gonna show you guys the new shadows I got they are all beautiful everyday colors. I got these eight bottom colors are brand new. The rest I already had. So I'm gonna go ahead and start, I think with this one here. It's like a matte brown, a light brown. It's called Jealous. It's called Jealous. Okay, and I'm gonna use my fluffy crease brush which has big dog hair on it. Can you guys see that? What the? That's awful. My dog doesn't even come down here. Okay, so I'm gonna start with this one in the outer corner. I think I still have some, another eye, eyeshadow on here, <laughs> probably. So I love that they came out with more everyday colors. You can never have enough nude eyeshadows. It's nice to have a variety of them. So I'm just applying this one kind of on the outer corner and then just blending it into the crease. And then I think I'm gonna go for, hmm, I'm gonna go, let's see. I'm gonna do this one here, kind of on the inner corner and then probably this one in the middle. So the lighter one is called, I think it's laid back. Yeah, laid back. My mind on my money and my money on my mind. All right, I don't know where all my brushes are. I've been off line, off line. <laughs> I was working night shifts and I left my stuff all over my desk and I think that my kids got into it because I'm missing a lot of my brushes. <laughs> I'm just gonna blame it on them. I'm just gonna blame it on them. 
but I'm missing my powder concealer brush which is my brush that I use for my foundation every day so I'm kind of stressing I've almost opened a new one but I'm not quite ready to do that I like this color a lot. This is a really great everyday color. And if you want your eyelashes to look longer, um, a light eyeshadow always helps. So that one is called Laid Back. And the other one in the crease is called Jealous. And then I'm going to add on covet, covetous. I'm not really sure how to say that one. We'll say covetous. Covetous. I'm going to put that one kind of on the outer half. It's really pretty. It's almost like a coppery tinge. I'm just going to go back in with that first color, Jealous. Oh, that's really pretty. I haven't done any foundation or anything. I'm sure you guys can tell. My mirror is not in the right spot. And this month our customer kudos is uh, you get to make your custom palette. So you get to choose the colors you want in your palette. You get to choose four. You get an epic mascara in black, brown, or waterproof black. And you get to choose your any liquid lipstick that you want. And we have three new nude shades. So I'm going to choose one more color, probably. Mm. Let's see. I can't even decide. I'm so so tired and indecisive. <laughs> I'm gonna do probably this one other color. It's like a gold, kind of in the middle. I'm just going back in with my fluffy crease brush, blending that in, okay, and I'm going to do, this is pretty dirty, Let's see if I have anything to wash this with, oh, I'm just going to grab my brush cleaner and clean this brush. And I'm going to use one of the browns as an eyeshadow. I love this brush cleaner because you don't actually have to let your brushes dry. So I'm going to go in with that first brown Jealous. What did I just drop? Okay. and just do like a soft eyeliner. I think I called it eyeshadow before. <laughs> I wanna do a soft shadow liner. Oh my gosh, I'm still like 
My brain is not turned on yet, guys. Okay, and then on the top I like to do liquid liner. So I'm gonna use, oh, this one is brown. That's perfect. That's the one I wanted. It just happened to be on my desk, which is weird because I haven't used this one in a long time. I think it's called Prominent. I'm, I like to do a pretty thin line, but you can go thicker if that's what you like. All right, and then I'm gonna go ahead and do my Epic Mascara. This is black. I wanna see if my other one is here. I'm gonna do waterproof, because just because my eyes have been watering like crazy lately, that's one of the reasons I haven't been doing eyeshadows is because I think I have allergies or something, because they've been like super itchy and um, watering, um, but because I'm like really bad with rubbing my eyes, I and I've been on night shift, I haven't been um, putting on eyeshadow for a long time. So I'm gonna do the waterproof just to make sure I have I don't usually have issues with the um, regular black but just with the amount that my eyes have been watering I just rather not risk it And then I will take a picture in the natural lighting because the artificial lighting, I mean, my lighting's pretty good, but you guys can't really get the true color of the eyeshadow. You always get it better through natural lighting. So I'll show you guys, I'll post a picture afterwards so you guys can see. All right. Okay. I'm gonna use, today for my foundation, I'm gonna use the Touch Cream Foundation. And this one is retiring, actually. I'm pretty sad about it because I have dry to normal skin. This one is great for dry skin. Um, and anywhere from dry, normal, or combination, if you have oily skin, I wouldn't recommend it. Um, but it comes in a compact, it's like a full coverage, it is a full coverage, and it's super easy peasy to apply. It covers, so it covers like all this redness. I think I'm just gonna wipe my, my lens, hold on a sec. I hope I don't like blind you guys, but it's kind of blurry, I think it's my camera. That's better um, so it's 50% off as I was saying until supplies run out so I stocked up on my shade um, I have a lot of customers that stocked up on their shades because it's such a good price you really can't go wrong it's great for sensitive skin my mom has uh, rosacea and she uses it 
to cover up the redness. So if you need a color match, you can message me. I feel like I needed to wake up somehow. <laughs> I had like a burst of energy this morning. I washed like so many dishes because there was like a mess left over from last night. So I cleaned up the kitchen. I vacuumed, which is exhausting when you have a clingy toddler um, whining and crying the whole time but I powered through <laughs> and um, went to get Serena from preschool. And I was like, you know, the moment you sit down, <laughs> you just feel exhausted. That was me. So I was like, I'm gonna come on and do my makeup. And I'm just gonna use this sponge to blend it in. Where did I put my spray bottle? There it is. I'm just gonna wet it. Hi, Lenore. Sure, you have dried and normal skin, I think. I'll message you after. It's a good sale. I'm actually kind of sad. I don't know why they're retiring it. I think with the liquid foundation, so many people um, maybe stopped using this one. I'm not sure. Sometimes it has to do also with the supplier. Low battery. But it is really good coverage, so I'm sad about that. Yeah, it's good for rosacea. Okay, so foundation is done. I'm going to just do a smidge of blush. And do my brows. I'm just gonna use the brow liner. I use the medium. And I like to outline the bottom. And then outline the top. And then just kind of fill in. I don't have a whole lot to fill in. Pretty lucky in that sense. I'm just gonna blend it, blend it in. See, it takes me like less than a minute to do my brows now, it's pretty crazy. It just takes practice. Don't you hate that? I do hate that when they retire products that you love or that my customers love. I'm like, why, why are you doing that? Okay, so I have two of the new liquid lipsticks. And I wanna share a tip with you guys because it's super important to exfoliate your lips. If you have dry lips, exfoliate every night. Uh, but sometimes you forget or you just have dry lips because it's winter and you live in the prairies and you don't drink enough water. <laughs> That's my issue anyways. So I'm gonna show you guys a trick. Okay, here's one of our lip glosses so I'm just gonna put like a dab on actually I'm gonna use the clear one hold on a second rewind but if you have dry lips you don't want to put on your liquid lipstick um, if they're like chapped or cracking because it's just not gonna look all that good to be honest okay 
okay? Because it's gonna like show all the dry, cracked up stuff. So if your lips are super dry, you can obviously exfoliate, um, but I like to just put a bit of uh, either a lip bonbon or um, a little bit of clear gloss underneath. You can also do it on top, but this is gonna add moisture to your lips right away. Our lip glosses are not sticky or I don't know what I'm what the word is I'm looking for. They're not sticky and they're moisturizing. That's what I was gonna say. They're moisturizing. So I'm gonna choose. I already tried the color snarky. I'll show you guys. It's like it's a really it's a bit of a darker, darker nude. It's pretty. Um, so I tried that one the other day. I liked it. It looked really good on. But today I think I'm going to try this lighter one. It's called S Subtle. <laughs> it's more subtle. Okay, so. Ugh, my mirror. I feel like my mirror is just not in a good spot today. And this one is like totally dirty. I love this one. I really love this one. That's really pretty. I feel like I would wear this pretty much every day. I think I might have found a new favorite. I really like this one. Okay, so this one is called Subtle. It's a, one of our new, we have three new shades. Hi, Jess! Three new nude <laughs> shades of lipstick. Say that fast three times. So this one is called Subtle. This one is Snarky. And there's a third one that's called Successful. And I had a really hard time deciding, but I ordered two of the kudos for myself. And I'm probably going to order the third lipstick, um when I place my next order, because I can't wait. Another thing I want to mention is that our glitter eyeliner is now available for sale by by itself. It was available in the kudos last month and I had a lot of girls asking me um, if they could buy it on its own, but now you can. So if you are interested, I am ordering. I think I'll place my order tonight if I have enough. I probably have enough, um, otherwise tomorrow. And these are $25 and they like they are gorgeous I love them they're super easy to apply they're just like our dip and draw liners um, it's like a little brush it's super cute and it's actually really subtle it's not like it's not a flashy thing it's really nice for like a real fun night out I don't know if you guys can see but that's pretty much it you got snarky is that the one I have? I don't even remember. I'm still like recovering from my night shifts. Yeah, I got snarky too. Subtle is really nice. But I've seen successful. It, it looks really pretty. It's more like a plum, I think. Plum rose is what they call it. I like all the nudes. That's my issue. But yeah. So I'm going to let you guys go because my battery is <laughs> less than 10%. Um, but yeah, if you guys are interested in this month's kudos, you can message me or the foundation. I'd be happy to color match you. Thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate all the likes and hearts and comments and I will talk to you soon. Bye.